right about now, we'll be having Tolulo Pekaya, the four hour poem. Can we give it up for her? A round of applause as she takes the stage. I came here to remember what it is to love poetry. Ten things I have learned about crushes. One, these are the symptoms to diagnose yourself of a crush. They, like a king in a palace, they have built a kingdom in your head. They make the whole soul stampede in your tummy and not just the butterflies. They feel like gravity, they are the center of the earth, you, the big rock, falling. This is where you run. Two, after you have made your diagnosis, this is where you deny, deny, deny. Secrecy is the soil on which crushes grow. They are the ones you are calling once a day just to say hi, and you don't even call your mother every day. <laughs> Three, should you decide to stay, note that this is a viral infection and must run its course. Try not to laugh too loudly at his jokes. It's not that funny, trust me. <laughs> Four, poetry is one of the things that make you you. This is how you wear your heart on your sleeve. This is how you make magic out of nothing. When you start sharing private poetry, test, uh, poetry with this person, this is the confirmatory test that you want them to like you back. Five, if you find a crush that vibes as you vibe, remember that fleeting, feelings are fleeting, so anchor yourself. Remember all that makes you you. Remember why you are where you are. Six, a crush is just setting emotions in motions. You know how they transform to love and become a choice. It is okay to run from this one so you will know when to stay. Seven, crushes go with playlists. For my first crush, it was someone like you by Adele. <laughs> my last crush had two songs because I had just watched all the boys I loved before and I was convinced I had found my Peter Kavinsky. <laughs> Eight, Crushes make for good poetry, so it's okay to write about them. It's okay to immortalize them in your words. Nine, when you start to withdraw, it will feel like coming off a high, like coming off coke. This is where you pray to God to take away your feelings. <laughs> this is how I know I am ready to let go. Ten, when you are cured and all your symptoms are gone, I hope you have fond memories and maybe a friend too. Thank you. <laughs>